हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल फार्मा ज्ञान फ्रेंड्स इन दिस चैनल यू कैन लर्न अबाउट फार्मास्यूटिकल गाइडलाइंस फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्रियल प्रैक्टिसेस प्रोसेसेस डॉक्यूमेंटेशन प्रैक्टिसेस एंड मेनी मोर अबाउट फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्रीज फ्रेंड्स प्लीज डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर माई चैनल फार्मा ज्ञान एंड प्रेस वेल आइकॉन गिवन इन बॉटम राइट कॉर्नर टू गेट लेटेस्ट अपडेट्स डायरेक्टली इन योर नोटिफिकेशन पैनल वेन आई अपलोड न्यू वीडियोज सो नेक्स्ट वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द वीडियो पार्ट फाइव ऑफ एट कंट्रोल ऑफ क्लीनिंग प्रोसेस इन ऑर्डर टू वैलिडेट अ क्लीनिंग प्रोसेस The cleaning process needs to be repeatable and sufficiently robust for the to be cleaned load. It should be clear which steps are considered part of the production process forward slash unit operation and which are part of the cleaning process. For example, if the pre-rinse or washout, which may be routinely applied to bring the equipment in a good starting position, is part of the overall cleaning process or not. Another example is the cleaning of chromatography columns. which are typically cleaned with buffers prior to the chromatography skid cleaning to assure repeatability and robustness of the cleaning adequate cleaning instructions are required for manual cleaning this is typically accomplished by sufficiently detailed cleaning instructions including an unambiguous description of the attributes to be used and how to handle these together with adequate training control of cleaning process continued the detailed description should consider the system boundaries cleaning agents forward slash solvents to be used volumes and or concentrations reflux or rinse times and temperatures the sequence of cleaning steps or predefined repeats in process analyses description of pumps used if needed sample instructions if needed For automated cleanings this should be ensured by the equipment design together with the cleaning software cleaning recipe and built-in control mechanisms For automated systems it is expected that a cleaning instruction covers 1 the applied cleaning phases for example once through versus recirculating versus soak versus reflux mode rinse forward slash wash phases 2 the sequences of the cleaning phases 3 time of each of the cleaning phases 4 action applied during the cleaning process note that the mechanical action forward slash impact is often flow forward slash pressure related for example if spray balls are being used 5 used cleaning agents and forward slash or cleaning solvents 6 the concentrations and forward slash or quality of the used cleaning agents and forward slash or cleaning solvents 7 temperatures applied during the various cleaning phases sample instructions if needed continued because of the uncertainties on cleaning parameters like ao flow time temperature detergent concentration and starting conditions inclusive dirty hold time and soiling and the geometric aspects of the clean system the cleaning process is susceptible to variability forward slash spread The mean effectiveness of the cleaning process together with its spread should be adequately removed from the edge of failure of the cleaning process which can be established by performing the mako calculations as discussed in the previous chapters at minimum the level of cleaning should support a cleaning result including the spread below the obtained mako level schematically this can be depicted as sample instructions if needed continued sample instructions if needed continued the level of cleaning should be commensurate to the level of risk that the cleaning process poses in relation to the related production processes notice that the cleaning risk can be further reduced either by 
improving the cleaning cycle to improve cleaning effectiveness and shift the mean cleaning result further away from the MAKO level, which typically requires cleaning development studies. Reducing process variability, which is typically established by increasing the level of control on the cleaning process parameters. An improved level of control on cleaning parameters such as flow, temperature and time, may not only result in more robust cleaning processes with smaller process variability, but may also create cleaning optimization opportunities, for example reduced chemical and water consumption. For automated systems, the level of control can often be enhanced by applying inline measurements together with enhanced controlling capabilities. Improved monitoring capabilities often results into enhanced cleaning process knowledge and may be used in a process analytical technology, PAT, framework.